Hello everyone! Welcome back to Chain Echoes. After 45 minutes of technical difficulties, I'm playing the game again. My god, that was horrendous. Um, it's been a few days. Let's uh, take a look at what we're doing. We got a lot of stuff uh, still on the reward board, but the last time we played, we managed to um, progress to the point to where we could unlock more portions of Ograin Grottoes, and that actually helped us clear up a couple of things, got us a couple of particular items. Um, we were able to upgrade Deagir and get some Tier 6 um, Sky Armors, so that's good. Uh, we now have a key, I believe, that gives us... Maybe not a key. Uh, we have something that gives us access to... Uh, the Diving Bell that gives us uh, access to the Fioran village in Arkant, so we can figure that out. Um, we got something else. We got the Golden Voucher, which just let us buy stuff for our Sky Armors, which we might actually still need to use. Um, uh, and we got access to the um, guy who does Ultimate Weapons. So we've got a bunch of different things going on. Uh, we might not be completely capable of doing 100% yet, but that's okay. Um, let me check our Sky Armors real quick and make sure that we are on 600s. No, we are not all on 600s. So, upgrade some of that. 300s. Get rid of those. Get rid of that old shit. Uh, hammer and shield. Um, okay. With that in mind, let's go ahead and sell... I guess we can sell whatever. Or... Sell to whoever, I suppose. We don't care anything about anything but 600s. Christ, there's so much. Yeah. Good, good. All right, what are we doing first? Tonight might not actually be a very action-packed night because I think we're going to potentially do some deal farming slash ultimate weapon setups um so we'll see how that goes but i think before we do anything else first we will save again but i think before we do anything else we might actually just go visit um the kraken and see how how much of a gap has closed now that we have um two tier six uh uh, Sky Armor is day as year up to tier 6, and then we have all 600 weapons. So let's see how things go now, shall we? So last time we tried this, we did target the healing one. But when that happened, um, the when we killed it, the other two got buffed. So I'm not sure that that's actually going to be a good thing for us in the long run. Uh, but we will see. We're going to try to still take it out. Uh, we are going to do a mix of things like blinding and enacting. That we can keep ourselves healthy, hopefully. Energy mode. Obviously. Uh, we're going to boost attack. Okay, not a problem. We are going to offensive 
smash the tentacle for now. Uh, we're now going to enact the physical. Okay, everyone has to be in whatchamacallit mode now. Okay, they are weak to wind. So, wind time. Oh yeah, that did the damage. Okay, so, now at this point, I think we want to press the wrong button and completely screw ourselves over. That's okay. That's, it's fine. Totally not fine, but it's fine. Right? It's, it's fine. Um... Offensive break here. Okay, now we are going to enact the magic tentacle. I did the wrong thing. Well, I didn't I didn't do the wrong thing, but I didn't do the right thing. Here we go. Nice. Okay. Let's go back into this situation. Um we are going to Actually, just drone swarm them. Okay, we do want to heal ourselves at this point, because we're about to get smacked, probably. We're going to silence here. Okay. Get hit. Cool. Fine. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That that did that real shit. Did we just do it? Yo! Kick the shit out of the crack in that time. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. I need a new beer. So I was right in the last time that we fought, right? Like it it was our tactics were correct. Whoa, did a shipwreck here? Must have been the place where Marileia crashed. I hope most people were able to escape in time. Mm, that probably not the case. Twenty-one thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. The wind tablet. Hey, so we got the the final tablet. Fourteen thousand eight hundred ninety-six. Repair kit DX times tur. Cool. So yeah, our our um. Our tactics the last time were correct. We just did not have strong enough sky armor slash gear. So cool. Yeah. Achika All right. Already off to a successful night after a horrendously bad start. <laughs> okay, uh, what is next on our list? I think next on our list, uh, we probably want to... Probably want to try doing ultimate weapons at this point. We should learn skills. We're kind of just learning whatever at this point. Counterattack up. I feel like I'd be a lot more interested in a lot of these, um, like, buff passives if they were less of a buff, but more of a guaranteed chance of happening. I guess, technically, they're guaranteed to happen in the manner in which they're guaranteed to happen, but I don't want to put my people at sub a quarter health to do that, or sub 30% health to do that. Anyways... 
We actually do, I believe, have Durandal. Right, so we have one of the ultimate weapons. Let's check and see what does it take. Rainbow Ore and Emperor's Hide. Okay, so... And Bloodstones. So yeah, we can absolutely start doing this. Swordmaster, crit up, and attack up. Okay. My god, this game needs a swap. Swordmaster. Attack up. And crit. And that is a piece of ultimate weaponry for Glenn. I guess let's um let's do the main people that we like. I say that we are somewhat gated by um who, what we have, right? Um Katana, definitely. Masamune. How classic. Um, we'll do the rapier. Oppenheimer. Okay. Uh, we'll do the amulet. Lapis Lazuli. Cool. Do the spear. Um, Knuckles, Vajra Mushti, this is where we start to get into characters that I care less about. Gun, I do like, or I want to like Amalia, Jaeger, nice. Eater. I guess the character I care the least about right now is Tomkey. Is that it? Did I? Got, 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 got. We don't have the cards. Got. We have this, but we don't have the souls. So we're missing Magnolia's cards, and we have Tomkey's ultimate weapon, but we have the Rusty, but we don't have the Soul of Varnese for it. Okay, let's go see how many of these we can actually upgrade. Uh, Focus on people that we consistently use. Masamune. Or Muramasa. Yep, we can do that. That rainbow ore is going to be a problem, isn't it? She looking at you? Oh, shit. You talk to her. She going to come to you now. Kachi. Okay, so Katana Master crit damage and HP drain. I didn't remove them. Katana Master crit damage and HP drain. Ow. Katana Master. Oh, Get rid of all those crit damages. Crit damage. And HP drain. Um, who's next? We'll do Oppenheimer. Or first side. We're gonna if everyone's require rainbow or we're we're gonna run out of that pretty shortly. Um remove from weapon. 
Rapier Master, HP Drain, and Crit Up. Okay. That ink weapon. Rapier Master. Crit Up. And HP Drain. Hello. Uh, other person that we are consistently using right now is Bathraz. Ancient Carcass. Okay. Glad it's not freaking the Rainbow War. Nice. Okay. Amulet Master, Magic Up, and HP Drain. Amulet Master. Magic Up. Oh, God. Suck either direction we go. That wasn't that bad. And... HP drain. Okay, cool. Um, probably spear next. Spear master, magic up, and HP drain. Cool. How's it going, head pigeons? Yeah, right there. Oh. Uh, the one person that is in chat right now, please look at the tree. Thank you. We will be festive over the course of the next three months, I'm assuming. Yeah, well, that's why I said at least by, I'm assuming in three months, I will uh, have either made you rearrange the living room I usually take it down around Valentine's or the cats will have destroyed it. I usually up for the, up for the True. All right. Uh, after that, let's do claws. We actually can upgrade every single one of these. That's really cool. I mean, we should use whatever the best weapon is for her right now. I really want to like Magnolia, but unfortunately I don't think I like her setup. No. Same for... Me. Good... Whatever he has, that's best. Okay. Cool. Well, that means that everyone has upgrades, so... Uh, Bowmaster, HP Drain, and Agi up. Bowmaster... HP Drain, and Agi up. What's up, Lippin' Dippin'? Hey, you want a treat? You want a treat? Otis also wants a treat. Whop. 
this. Okay, kitty cats got treats. Uh, Jaeger. Pistol Master, HP Drain, and Crit Up. Bye. It's that's so many. Oh god, I overdid it. I really don't care about anything else right now though. I doubt I will uh, I will change my gear unless there is something that is such a difficult fight that I feel like I have to come in with like some sort of resistance or H HP up or some shit. And if that happens, I'll just go farm it. I'll be very sad that I did this to myself, but I'll just go farm it. Okay, um... Own goal meal. Spearmaster, attack up, and HP train. Spearmaster. Attack up. HP drain. Um, party on the right thing there. Great sword, great sword, attack up and HP. Great sword, attack up and. HP drain. Fuck yeah. Um, who is up next? Claw Master crit up and crit damage up. Okay. Anchor Master, HP Drain, and Crit Damage Up. Cards, card master, crit damage up, and magic up. Gotcha. Sweet. 
Okay, now to equip everyone with the new stuff. Ooh, boy! Almost 200 on Glenn for attack power. Um, Almost 200 on magic for Bathraz. Victor remains our weak boy, but he's support. That's fine. Only 150 on uh, Sienna. I actually don't think she has her attack up support. But, you know, she has 65% crit, so... Uh, great off. Our only person so far to break 200, Lene. Nice. I'm sure if we uh, go set everyone to their optimal stuff, that will change. So everyone who doesn't have a 10 now has a 9. So Tomkey and Magnolia are the only ones that don't have 10s, and they both have 9. Well, I do not class that. Because we have not gotten the class from Ograin yet. Um, okay. Um, technically... Do have armor upgrades... Yes. I'm not sure I care about doing those right now because we're about to probably go try to do some um, deal grinding. Deal grinding, but... Why well, I'm flying over there when I can just teleport. So, anything that is not currently equipped. Cool. Heels. Uh, let's sell this stuff first. New deals! Nice. Uh, we get the ultimate troll. Tr what? Includes an ultimate armor of every type. Holy fuck. Ah. Very nice. Okay. One triplet, one grimoire robe, one ringmail, one maximilian. So, if we do all of the ultimate... Uh, armors, we will end up with three ultimate armors for each type. I don't think that actually um, does. Yeah, so we have one parade. I think the heavy armor is our issue. One, two, three, four. We have four people set up with heavy armor. Uh, I mean, technically, we don't have to have one of them set up with heavy armor. But at the end of the day, it feels weird not to. We have our three obvious magic users. One, two... Our one, two, three obvious light armor users. It's just the medium armor scenario. We could take, like, Glenn off of the heavy armor, I suppose. From a... I guess from, like, a roleplay standpoint, it makes sense. Alternatively, we could just not use someone like a Gil... And that would mean that we don't need him to have the heavy armor. But... Before we do that... Okay, Hannah dolls... Uh, we could go farm them, I suppose. Um, so, I guess let's make a list, fuck. Let's make a list!
Um, what else do we need? Flesh cap. One. Okay. Um. Otter owl. Otter owl. One. Okay. Ah! Press the wrong button. Okay, so we gotta get the re gob the goblin head from Bog the real gob, which not been able to find him yet. We need long tails from Tad Eyes. Or Alright, cool. Two butterfly ribbons from Hannah Dolls in O'Grain, one flesh cap from DeCapo in Perpetua, one otter owl from Hair Otters in Arcants, um, two clockwork yellows from Golem Knights in Ruminus, one goblin head from Bog, the gob, the real gob in O'Grain, four long tails from Pet Eyes. Um, what else do we have? We have the. In I'm going to put this on lesser, but one hairy crown. Arthros. Forwards. Hammering scale from the Aurora dragon. So this is just fighting specials, basically. Orb. All right, where to first? Where to first? Ah, um, okay, let's go to Rominus. Kick the shit out of some Golem Knights. I, is there a... Fuck, I don't remember. I do not remember. Teleportation in. It's not a teleportation in, but that will be faster. Hey, how's it going, Wild? How goes the gaming tonight? Um, now that we're actually gaming pretty well, but it was a very rough start tonight. <laughs> um, it was uh about forty five minutes of technical difficulties, because the game just decided why not. Uh, but you know it'd be what it be. Okay, we've got a bunch of those berries. We should go face off against the Tad Eyes. Uh, maybe we'll do that while we're here. It would be nice to to open up some stuff and see what's what. But I kind of want to get the ultimate gear while we're around and about, you know? 
Because then all of the things that we're facing, we're going to be as basically strong as possible. My god, ow. Got the hiccups. How are you doing tonight, Wild? Okay, Golem Knights. Those guys. So we do need to pay attention to them. Um, let's do a... Poison Salvo. Must be one of those days for... T it's, yeah, sometimes it just happens, right? Like, I when I got home, everything was perfectly fine. Um, you know, I watched chilled, watched a little bit of anime, everything was working, um, and then right before I started streaming, like, I even, I booted up Streamlabs, everything was working fine, but I had not restarted my computer since last night, and last night my, the freaking capture service fails every time I capture Windows in, um, Discord, so it, it creates jank with other things, so to fix that, I reset my computer, right? So reset my computer, and Razer updated and broke all my sound settings. Um, but the game capture all worked fine. So I had to spend like 20 minutes fixing ra various sound settings. And by fixing, I mean basically restarting my computer until it worked, or it decided to work. Uh, and then when it started working, the game... Server, game capture decided it didn't want to work anymore and I was just like okay well fuck me I guess so it's been a bit of a mess but you know it happens comes with the territory uh, we are going to offense break the golem knight Energy flow. We're supposed to be having a one shot with your group, and your roll twenty decided not. In fact, so you're <laughs> sometimes right. Sometimes it do be that way. It's just like, wait, what? What? Why? Can can we not? And it's like, no, we must. All right, are these guys all, these guys are all water, I believe. Not bad. Yikes. Okay, this is like the hardest fight and it's not that hard, so. The, like, the hardest fight here, and it's not that hard. For clarification. Whoa! Oh, don't heal yourself. What is that? Some noise right there. Deleted all the prep, or you didn't save, or something? Oh. Ooh. Maybe they did, like, a rollback or something like that? I, I know they... I don't know. It's just... That's really crappy, unfortunately. I'm sorry to hear that. I was not paying attention to our fucking shit. Uh, we need... What do we need? We need two clockwork yellows from Golem Knights. Uh... We have one of those. No, we, we do not have any of those. Those are these things. We have, we got clockwork reds. Okay, so no dice so far. Fine. Just means it'll be the start of a new year one shot rather than... Yeah, that's fair. Perfectly fair. Hey. Uh, water shot on this thing? No, fire shot on this thing. Interesting. Huh. 
Mash. Mash! Clockwork yellow! Nice! We only need one more of those. Uno mas, lippin' dippin'. Uno mas. No. It's going to be kind of crap, but I think there might only be two Golem Knights. Yeah, it looks like there's only two Golem Knights um, in here. So... Aya! Reset to O'Grain. Run it on back. Thanks to the recap series. Oh! You're finally almost caught up? Hell yeah. Awesome. Unfortunately, only on episode 90. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't know if I'd quite call that almost caught up. You're about halfway there. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. I, I finally finished uh, rendering all of the recap series, so I'm considering putting out more than one a day at this point, just to kind of get it out there and done, and so that people who want to use it as, as a catch-up can use it as a catch-up. But at the same time, um, I don't know that I want to front-load that work. Bit of sarcasm there, yeah. Yeah. I feel ya. I feel ya. Okay, um... I kind of think I'm just going to leg sweep repeatedly. Not great, but it is what it is. He, he has the chance to do status effects, so leg sweeping could, um, you know, like paralyze someone or, or do something like that just to kind of like make things a little less annoying. Repair all. X. Hard. Poison. Okay, well, you know. Bad. Uh, we will probably just drone swap. Not bad. Clockwork red. Don't care about that. Sleep! Hella! Nice. Another Clockwork Red. Don't care about that. Wild Slash. Um, defense Break. Point of Dance. Nice! And Fire Shot. Rainbow Ore. No! I don't need the rainbow ore. I need the clockwork yellow. Please and thank you. I actually enact that guy. Sit down. Just wanted to dance. But get lucky, but we didn't. That's fine. He didn't heal, which is nice. Clockwork yellow! Fuck yes! Alright, well, we are done here. We no longer need clockwork yellows. Hello. Okay, um, let's. Let's go mosey on into some Tadai territory. Because that seems like a lot of fun. We also need Hannah dolls. Two, two, well, two butterfly ribbons from the Hannah dolls in Ograin, But I think those are only, only going to be on the other side. 
don't think that they're gonna be over here. Uh, let's save before we lose the progress that we have made. Don't want to fight the Kraken again or farm those. Um, or go actually do all of the um, gear upgrades. That's the biggest thing. Items! The one time we actually care about using items. Yata! Sir, be weakened! Absurd. X slash. Easy peasy. We didn't get the thing that we need from the tat eyes, though. We need long tails from the tat eyes. Bringing the money chests at this point in the game feels so bad. They really do. It feels so bad. Not happy about them at all. Hey! I'm happy about that, though. That's cool. Actually, uh, we should check our skills. Learning, 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 learning. Not learning. Not learning. Okay. Also not learning. Learning. Uh, level up. Level up. Let's see if we can just swap those two. That would be really nice. Move. Oh, right. She's... I've got the thing. Understood. I forgot. That's fine. Um, Firestorm. Earthstream. Keep me up. Ether Killer. Save. What special hell is this? We don't have any sacred water. Fuck me. 88,000 da damage? Yeah. Those fuckers are basically invincible without using the item on them. Which, is, which means we have not been able to come into this area because of that, so. Longtail! We got one longtail. Nice. We need three more. Sacred water! Thanks, game. I do appreciate that. I do appreciate the fact that you were like, oh, let's put the last sacred water next to the last, the last statue. Lippo, are you being sweet and cleaning, Oni? I don't think he actually wants that. Hey, you greet me. I'm an adventurer. Thanks. I appreciate it. The question is, who are you, last cl class? And what are you going to make me face? My goodness. It's kind of horseshit. Um, do I do I just bury every one of them? Can they kill me if they're buried? I don't fucking know. I don't know if we. I don't know if the strat is bury every one of them, or if the strat is bury three of them and then kill three of them with the last person. We'll try burying all of them and seeing how horribly that goes. Oh no, they do. They do nothing after they've been buried. Nothing. Oh, that's that's so wrong. That's very, very bad for them. Goodbye. Oh wow. Ooh, two long tails. Mark it. So I don't fucking forget. Did not get a long tail on that one. Good news. Good news. You had to go to the doctor. Oh, right. To see how your legs are healing. And it turns out the damage to your ankle could require surgery in order to heal. 
from what you understood. A bone splintered and got into the joint, and it's thick enough that it could be problematic. You and I, I, I assume this is another uh, uh, scenario of sarcasm. Because otherwise, you and I have different definitions of good news. That really sucks. I, I hope that it all works out it, for the best in the long run. Oh my goodness. What did we get? We got the Mage Warrior. Confused fighter who does not know what they want to specialize in. Magic Smash, a physical attack using the magic stat. That's kind of cool. And Physical Wonder, a magical attack using the attack stat. Why? Fire attack deals weakness damage. Okay, and water attack. Gotcha. Why the fuck not? Why? Just why not? <laughs> My goodness. That's a, uh, that's a hell of a class. That is a hell of a class. All right, you asshole, let's go. Actually running through our stockpile of berries pretty quickly. I did not expect there to be four tad eyes in that fucking... Not getting any fucking um, drops out of them. It's no bueno. Did I miss that? Go look around real quick. Feel like I missed something. Probably didn't know. Ah, yes. There's a spot to climb down right here. Hey! It's our guy! Hello, friend. Your left leg is healing perfectly and has no issues, so 50-50? I would... I'd rather a 50-50 than a 0-100. Or 100-1-0. I think it would be 0-100. You know. Gimaj? Why are you interrupting my training? Wait, are you the Crimson Wings? You're still pretty green behind the ears. If you're fighting for the good of Volandis, you better train harder. Since my training has been interrupted here anyways, I'll help you. Let me be your trainer. Oh. If chance to gain 50% or no, 50% chance to gain additional SP. That's cool. I would have loved to have had that earlier in the game. But I understand, you know, the concept of giving those things late for finishing stuff up. That's fair. I haven't done a whole lot of SP grinding um, anyways, so that doesn't that doesn't hit particularly hard. I'm not like, oh shit, I spent six hours grinding SP, so... Bruh, 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 bruh. I mean, I did spend like an hour fully grinding out the SP on... Um, uh, whatchamacallits on the Sky Armors, but I think that was very worthwhile and honestly not especially difficult. Ooh, oh, this is where the tablets go. Oh, we're missing two. I thought there were only going to be four, but there's six. I'm assuming like a light and dark. I'm assuming a light and dark. Looks like an item would fit here. Looks like an item would fit here. Oh, I bet. Yo, 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 yo. I bet this shit summons this guy. I, I bet this is... We gotta get all the tablets to summon the God King Gamdriel. How bad your legs look at the time. You can see why the docs didn't catch the splinter. Well, yeah. I mean, it would have been preferable if they had, but... Can be somewhat understandable why, why they maybe did not. Oh, we need to keep an eye out for hidden caves. Let's do that on our way back out. Oh, we don't have to do that. Uh, we ha we have a 
we know? If we know, because we can uh, see on the scenario. Okay, let's go do the Hannah dolls. Find all recruits. Oh, and here is our thing. Okay. So it's here somewhere. We'll drop, just see. Okay, it's not here. And this drops us all the way into the desert thing. Teleport to the wrong spot, my bad. Let's just ultra move these guys. I really don't want to go to work tomorrow, but I need to not take any additional time because I want to take more time around like Christmas. It's the uh, vicious cycle. I say vicious cycle, it's not especially vicious. Hey, light claymore. Get that weakness, fuck yeah. Ballad of the Wind. Not bad. The most vicious cycle of the year. He's been looking at him nonstop. He, like, in clean mode. Skill level up. Hey, it's right here. I just... Not bad. I just missed it earlier. Bloodstone. All right, well, whatever. Okay, we got to find Hannah dolls. There we go. Uh, we need two butterfly ribbons from them. Butterfly ribbon. Nice. Yeah, that's one. Yeah, yeah. Pretty decently smoothly so far. Potato shaped turtle. Oh, right. I forgot there were so fucking many of these here. Somewhat concerning. Ultra move! We got a single poison. That's fine. You feeding that boy? Are you? Uh oh. Yeah, she been licking him for. 300 years. That's the mama's job. Yeah, that's the mappa's job. Uh. Uh. Hello? Really like a single Hannah doll in this thing? Ah, uh, here we go. All right. Go, go, Geary. Ballad of the Wind. I'll do... No, his is a single one. Yeah. I wonder if I get anything from them if they kill themselves. Hmm. 
I did. Nice. Butterfly ribbons are done. Hell yeah. Lippo, go give me another beer. Go give me another beer. Oh, yeah. Hold, yeah I, I love the, hold up, let me build a mech so I can beat your ass, do a shit ton of damage, and also... Oh, Mama got me a beer. That's so nice. Um, and also debuff you at the same time. Like, it's, it's honestly probably the best ultra move in the game. It's it's just so fucking good. Okay, we still need more tad eyes. So, um let's teleport reset here and see if we can't get one more long tail from the tad eyes over here. Uh, items, no berry, Whop. and light sword, Whop. didn't get it, okay, there's also supposed to be another, like, there's supposed to be, like, a bigger one of these, I don't know how to spawn him, though. Long tail, long tail done. Sweet. All right, we still need to do bog the real gob, but I don't especially know how to accomplish that. I also don't know how to get up there, or I guess I'm down from there. That's interesting. Um, what now? What now? What now? Let's go to... Uh, Archant. We need to... We need to get Otter Owl hair from the... Otter? Or from the... I don't know. From something. I think there were those guys. Otter Owl. I don't fucking rightly remember what those are. I thought the only otter thing that we fought was Decapo. Not Decapo. Uh, otter Nobunaga. Otter Nobunaga. Can we go in here now? Went too far. Gods now. Uh, let's save. Yes. Find the secret place. We've done it. Very nice. We need to check and see if anyone is at max. 957 is pretty high. 954 is pretty high. Not quite there. That's fine. What? Oh. Welcome to Lier. My name is Ulut. I'm the leader of the small village. I've heard you are the Crimson Wings clan. You're helping to end the war, right? That's something that's affecting us as well. We hope you succeed on your mission. Okay. That's fine. Special magic shield makes sure that only minimal water enters this place. If it would vanish, the freshwater Fiorans would have a problem. The fungus is impressive. In the beginning, it spread very slowly, a few meters a day. That's not slow, but in the end, it could cover several kilometers a week. Dear Lord Jesus, if the ocean had not stopped it, it would have covered all of Eldrea by now and destroyed all of humanity. But most people are blissfully blissfully ignorant of its existence. Peace. The only people who fear it are the fugitives who had left the ancient empire of Galtena in flight from the fungus and now live scattered throughout the world. A kingdom of a thousand of thousands of years was swallowed by a lousy mushroom. 
within a few decades. Hard to imagine. Hold my fucking beer. Huh. I did not realize that Lousy and Lousy were... I probably shouldn't say them differently. I bet they're said the same way. Lousy. Yeah, they're said the same way. I always thought that those were two different words, right? I always thought that lousy, obviously, meaning like bad or crappy or whatever, right? Like was a particular word. And then lousy, meaning infested with lice, right? Was a different word. But apparently they're spelled the same way. I did not realize that. I don't particularly use the, the lice per one very frequently, so. But the danger is far from over, for the fungus unceasingly wants to expand and always seems to find a way. A few years ago, it was found on the southern coast of Jadar, north of Galtena, across the ocean. A ship must have brought it in while fleeing. The Sultan of the Revolution unleashed an entire army to destroy all traces of this fungus, but apparently they missed something, and the fungus began to swallow the continent as it once did in Galtena. People, animals, and monsters fled from the south towards the north. This migration was called the Jadar Exodus. Truth is, there is nowhere to flee. Looking at Galtena, the fungus will also swallow the whole of Jadar within the next few years, and it will not pause until it reaches the next ocean. The world must be informed. It's time for something to happen. See, okay, so I I have, uh, you thought Lousy and Lousy were the differences, the more you know, right? Right? Like, I always assumed that there was something, but yeah, no, I mean, it, it looks like it's the same, same spelling, you know? So, I've said this before, but I actually really like the world building of this game. Like, these various lore novels that you can find are really cool. And they paint a very interesting picture of the world um, that exists. And I would love to see more games set in this world to explore these other things. Right? Like, how cool would it be to play a RPG like Chained Echoes where... You're on Jadar, right, in the next couple of years, and you're trying to figure out a way to end this fungal menace, right? Or slow its progression or something like that, you know? Plenty of interesting uh, options there. You're wondering why we do not live directly in the water, but in this place full of air. Have you gone mad? Do you think we're some kind of fish? A part of human society. How do you think we would read books made of paper underwater? How would we build stuff without any fire? We're not underwater cavemen. Alright, just come at me, why don't you? Jesus. I'm heading out to fish. Hopefully I can catch a pig here. Last time I caught a heom. That was awkward for both of us. That is awkward. Bloodstone! Um, I... I think there's something up here that I missed. Oh, maybe not. There's just very weird textures there. You know of a couple games with plots similar to that so you can see it? Yeah, absolutely, right? And there's plenty of ways that you could twist and turn it, right? Like, it can be a completely non-sentient, right, type of scenario, and you could turn it into, like, a... Not a survival horror, but, like, a, a, a that kind of, like, edge where maybe instead of, like, fighting back against the fungus, the fungus has taken control of Jadar, but maybe a few, like, cities or, or like, points have come up with methods to repel the fungus. And so it turns into a scenario of, like, you know, almost a Nausicaa-esque kind of scenario where you're, like, surviving against that wilderness and, and you know, there's some other political conflicts going on between the surviving you know, uh, associations and blah, 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 blah. Or you can go the route where it's like, oh, actually the fungal scenario is the extension of a sentient will, right? And that, that becomes a discovery. So then the goal becomes find that sentient will and take it out so that the fungus stops or 
you know, plenty of other, yeah, fungus as a side effect or what, there's so many different routes that you could go with it. And that's just one of the story building things. There's a bunch of different, like, because Volandis is like this little um, island continent in the center of a ring of larger continents. And um, they've all got really interesting stuff going on. And it, it sounds like a very cool world. My wife is the best fisher around. She can throw the bait hundreds of meters onto the land. They fish on land. Okay, that makes sense why they're catching piggers and, and uh, heoms then, I suppose. Jeez. Jeez, Louise. What you got? I might look like a Fiorin, but I'm actually a Demi. In my case, a mix between a Fiorin and a Polko. I don't know what that means. You look like a shop owner. Can you not sell me something? Why did they let you in? We haven't had any visitors for, visitors for decades. They didn't let me in. I let myself in. There's a difference. Rainbow or eight. I'll take that. I'll take that gladly. All right, hold hold the fucking phone. I'm gonna say there's a there's a lot of shit here. Maltet. Okay, well, unfortunately, we have. I say unfortunately. There's the tier 9 spear for Lene. We already have the ultimate weapon, though. So, you know, guess we don't need that anymore. Hey, Soul of Farnese. Nice. Very nice. Uh-huh. Figured it out. I knew this shit in the side was weird. Tekka. Okay, so that will be the tier 9 for... I just skipped right past her. My bad. Yeah, that's the tier 9 for uh, Mika. So. No worries. Alright, that means we are only missing one rusty weapon. The rusty cards. And we're only missing one soul of our knees. Um, so, cool. We're getting there. We're very much getting there. Absolutely. This is going to take us to that guy. Hey, guy. You've entered the village by using a diving bell. Wow, you guys are something else. Welcome to Lahir. Thanks for keeping us out the whole fucking time. Rusty cards, I guess. That, yeah, I mean, initially I was like, that's fucking weird. But, you know, at the end of the day, it's is it is it really the weirdest thing? Not so much. Uh, Otter Owl Hair. Otter Owl Hair. I don't know what the fuck that is. Otter Owls. Okay. East area it is. Um. Oh. King out. That would make sense. Dungeon enemies. Did I miss something? Ooh, oh, oh, ah! I feel tricked. I got a beer. Actually, in a moment, I'm going to
I did not eat dinner, so cheese puffs are now my dinner. Do not do as I do. Alright, this is the only otter that I'm aware of. That is an otterly interesting name, Nobunaga. Absolutely, right? Hmm. Somewhat concerned. Some somewhat concerned. Hmm. Did I misread that? What's happening here? Uh, there is an entry over here. I mean, that still wouldn't make sense, though, because, like, we literally haven't seen a creature named an otter owl. So there's got to be some something. Uh, um, actually, yeah, let's, let's go check. Make sure I have the right fucking... Hermit's Isle. We're gonna, we're gonna, oh, shit! Our place looks snazzy as fuck now. Um, what was I looking for? I was looking for... No, it's deals. Sorry. Deals. Otter Owl. We're looking for an Otter Owl dropped by Harry Otter in the Archont Archipelago. Okay. That's what I was actually just thinking, is my assumption was, I remember earlier on in the game talking to one of the guild members, and they said something about a beach scenario. And then when we bat we went back to um, Arkant, we found Otter Nobunaga, so I assumed that it was... But, I think that that guy actually specified two different um, beach scenarios. So I think that means that there are two, two different otters, one of them being Otter Nobunaga, and the other being this hairy otter. Let's take a look around before we uh, vacate. It's kind of cool. Our shit's all upgraded. The beds in the inn are mainly for foreign guests. We've really come far. Fuck yeah. What's up, fam? Everyone helps the Crimson Wings in their own way. I might be no big help on the battlefield, but boy, can I clean some bed sheets. Fuck yeah. What? Didn't want a back seat, but it got you curious. I I don't I don't mind. I try to be hesitant when I say I don't mind things, right? Because sometimes I do mind things, but I don't mind this, right? Invited by General Ferran to the island. I'm a merchant from Miranda. Your fleet is quite big. If the negotiations work out fine, the Crimson Wings might soon be a new client of mine. Cool. Hey! Pickle gun. Fucking pickle gun. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Sure thing, boss. This is a... This is a whole ass, like... It's a nice place now. I should put, like, some gates up or something. Otherwise, I'm not sure why we got all these fucking walls, but... You know. Holy shit! An ambassador from Arnsreich. I think, I think the Crimson Wings will be an important political figure in Volantis' future. That's pretty fucking cool. Hey, Kylie, and we achieved your dream. 
These offices are for or important for if we invite foreign diplomats. The Crimson Wings are slowly becoming more than a simple clan or resistance group. We are known outside of Landis. That's pretty fucking dope. If we can sign the contract, the Crimson Wings will get the provisions from the free will get provisions from the free cities. Interesting. Well, how do you like the results? We even fortified against enemy attacks. Get some gates. Give me your knowledge. That? Ooh! We got the walking library achievement. We have now read all of the lore books in the game. Fuck yeah. That was actually an achievement that kind of concerned me because I, I didn't have a good way to track it. And I was worried that eventually I would just have to like, I guess I'll look up where all the lore books are if I don't find them all. But we got them. Nice. Hell yeah. Batteries are the most amazing invention of our time, which do not even come from our time. They are able to store energy, and I don't mean ether, but electricity. Batteries are vessels that can trap lightning. They don't generate it any more than a cooking pot can produce water, but they help transport it. This allows us to make sky armors fly in the air without a permanent connection to a generator. But unfortunately, this greatest achievement of the modern age is a relic of an older generation. We don't know how to build them must cling to the relics unearthed by the Gandabranth Society, which are sold for a fortune. Another thing that I think would be really interesting, because I feel like we've only scratched the surface of the Gandabranth Society in this particular game. They are the gifts of an ancient civilization that shape our mod modernity. A sad testament to the scientists of our times. It's time to make a change. We need to uncover the secrets of batteries. Pretty, pretty interesting. Pretty dope! Cool. Look at my office. Quite nice, isn't it? I'm making good money with all the sky armors you break. The fuck? You and Berseria and Skits had a Google relationship for achievement really reasons? My god, I can only imagine. Berseria, just in the brief time that I played it, had so much going on. I'm actually really looking forward to Jay and I playing it. We're very close to being done with Wizard with a Gun. Mystic Ring. Uh, let's look at these each in turn because I will forget what we get. So. Uh, so Mystic Ring. I skip it? Here. Oh, we already had one. Mystic Ring. Seriously? You don't tell me what things are there? Mystic Ring, TP, Defense Mind, and... Okay, raises TP by 10%. Gotcha. That's a useful one. But yeah, I'm actually really f looking forward to playing Berseria with Jay. Knightly Sword, Plot Armor, and Life Thread. What's that? I think we already had one of those. Um, Yeah, we already had one of those. Crit 15! Ah! Yes! Somebody fucking put that on. Sixty-five percent crit on Bathra's now. Very nice. Very nice. Hell fucking yeah. I think we have most of our work done. I'm leaving a few trees just so it feels more comfy. Fuck yeah, Jack. Thanks for your work. Hard work. There's a slide! My tree is gone. Oh, poor Bao. Lene is cooler than Glenn. She could defeat him anytime. He's a Valkyrie after all. I don't know about that. Glenn's kind of busted. Hey, bro. Cool. Why do y'all have all these fucking weapons just out here in the elements? Like, what the fuck? What are y'all doing? Build an armory. Get to work. We all done. We all done there. 
Hell yeah. Very cool. Oh, I bet uh, a minor guy is done. <laughs> Last solo Barney's. Fuck yeah. Kind of surprised that he said the same thing there. But it is what it is. Not a lot changed inside. That's fine. Hey, where are your cards? Do you, do you know where your cards are? It'd be nice if I knew where your cards were. Maybe this fisherman will have caught something at this point. Hey, did you catch anything? Something's biting. It's gonna be rusty cards. I swear it's gonna be rusty cards. It's definitely gonna be rusty cards. It's a soul of Farnese. Wait. We have three? Wait. Ten. 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 Ten, 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 ten. One, two. We only have two characters that pull up. Do we need souls to do? No. No way, right? That. No way we would need souls of Farnese to do the ultimate armors. Which means either they give you more souls than you need, or there's another character to use them on? Oh, shit! Yo. Yay. Fucking wonderful. I'm very glad that they all loved <laughs> that no one no one borked. What do you think? Isn't it a nice place to relax? I thought this was gonna turn into like a hot springs or something, right? A secret hidden new game plus character would be funny? That would be funny. Yeah, I might have overdone it with all the animals. Uh, I think this is great. I'm a little concerned about these monkeys, but, you know. I feel what it be. That's pretty cool. Oh, wrong place. I want to check the rooms. And nothing. All right, cool. No worries. What do we want to try now? I think... Huh. Was it the guy at the Hoog that told me about Archont? This guy? Remember? Yeah. Some folks want to chill at the beach naked. Then some monstrosity appeared. When they put their clothes back on, it disappeared. Right, so that's how we got Otter Nobunaga, I thought. Because we took all of our clothes off. There's a beach where an enemy is drawn to when a lot of magical users appear. Okay. Alright, so we need a magic crew. Okay, uh, let's try a formation of more magical people. Who counts? Uh, let's put Lene. She definitely counts. And let's put Magnolia. She counts. I think the question is, does does Victor count? And that I'm not sure about. So we'll see.
We haven't saved in a while, I should say. Ay, ay, ay. Nice. Harry Otter? I just now fucking got it. God damn it. Harry Otter? That's fucking... That's funny. Right there. That's pretty solid. Harry Otter is weak to dark. We don't have dark on us right now. Ah, fuck it. Heaven's here. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be very strong at this point. Um, Hero code. Bomb, 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 bomb. You wonder if he was a potter in a past life? He might have been. Uh, tornado 10, whatever. Two! Well, it wasn't a failure. Ooh. He heals himself for a lot. Gotcha. Let's see if we can paralyze him. We can. Oh. Okay. All right, we got it. Otter Owl acquired. Fuck yeah. Uh, nice. We need flush cap from Decapo. I don't remember exactly where he was. How did we... It's a common drop. How did we not get it? Alright. This one we've already fought before. So I don't particularly care. Um, Chained Echoes Decapo Location. There's a cave in the northeastern part with a switch. Just go in and out until Decapo, Decapo pops up outside. What? Up here? No. It was... Over here? I think it was. I think it was, like, down in this area. A switch. Ooh. Northeastern part. It wouldn't have been further north. Yeah, it wouldn't. I don't think it was this far. North? I don't remember. I don't remember enough. Hmm. Actually, I think it was down there. Wasn't it? There was something down here. Odd. All right. Easiest thing. Look at a video. Please tell me why. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Definitely can.
Ah, I see. I see where it is. I was nowhere near the correct location. That's fine. I'll cheat my ass off. I don't care. It's not a spoiler to me if it's something I have learned or done, but just forgotten. Ooh, ah. Oh, right. This is the O'Grain place that we've been to before. I, I know. I'm just messing back. Jay and I have this, uh, I, I've known Jay for so long that I've gotten into this thing of, like, constantly being sarcastic back with people. And I don't mean it in any negative way, it's just a, yeah, it's just that constant, like, oh, what? You, you gotta, you gotta retort? I gotta retort back, you know, type scenario. Oh! Plunger Beams! Nice. That does actually have quite a bit of health. Oh, we're we're still on the other team. Not that this is a bad team. Oh, we didn't get it. Mm, sadness. Well, let's go back to our normal team. And uh, is this what we want? I guess. I suppose. That's fine. I will say swap that. Can he spawn twice in... Look, I only one-turned it because I used an Ultra. I wouldn't have one-turned it otherwise. Ah! Almost one-turned it, but not quite. I guess if all four of my characters had been able to go, I would have gotten it. Damn. Still did not get the thing. What do I need out of him? I need a... I need a flesh cat, and it's a common item. Oh! Whoops. That's okay. He's stuck around. Back for it. Gim, please. Give me the common item from the enemy. Why do you hate me? Woo! Got it! The desire, yes, absolutely. You do not get the things that you want, but that's okay. We did it. Flesh cap from that thing done. Did we, I don't remember, did we get the ability? I should have just teleported. I'm bad at this. Did we get the ability to operate the damn, um, whatchamacallit? Damn, uh, uh, elevator. Don't think so. Yeah. That's gonna be the last fucking thing I get because it's 
just something that I've missed. I guarantee it's someone that I have to, like, talk to or some shit, and it's just something that I've missed. Oh, bomb. Oh, bomb. He's deary. We are looking for Arthos in Dior Woods, which I actually think is another unique that we missed. Looks like it. Fucking Harry Otter. Okay. Um. Your woods? Where is that guy? Is it right here? Uh. He's not right here, but he's up here. We'll go. Kids were playing in the center of the Orwoods. They were chasing each other around a group of trees, and a monster appeared. That's Excalibur. And then there is a monster in Fior Woods who is best friends with a turtle. If you kill the turtle and don't leave the forest, it will try and take revenge. Someone got ambushed by it on these wooden bridges in the west. Okay. So. Arthos being Arthur with Excalibur. Gotcha. So. Uh, we actually want to bounce and then set back in because that puts us in the place to kill Excalibur. And then we need to go from Excalibur... to the west without leaving. Gonna be easy. Surely gonna be easy. Hey! Nice, got it. Okay, so I don't know if we actually have to walk there, but we're just going to walk there. Because I don't want to risk teleporting, breaking shit. So, we will just walk our happy asses over there. And we will. I remember when these dragons were a fucking nightmare. And now we just two-shot them. Very nice. Much wow. Oh, wait. Oh, no, that's fine. Look, y'all could live if you just would not fight me. You're choosing this. I need you to know that. Okay. 
Time to get ambushed by Arthos. I wonder what Arthos is going to be. Maybe up here? Plug it. Used to play Mana Hunt a lot, and every time you were looking for a common drop, oh yeah, all the fucking time. But of course, when you're looking for a particular rare, that thing never fucking shows up, right? Like when you're looking for it, it'll it'll be like the first time you hunted a monster, um, you get its two percent drop, and then every other time you want that two percent drop, it's like nah, 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 nah. Hey, Arthos is a bunny. Is that a Monty Python reference? I feel like this might be a Monty Python reference. Huh. Interesting. We didn't get the thing. I wonder if we cycle if he will uh, if he'll just ambush us again. Kind of like we did with DiCapo, right? Like been forever. It's also been forever since I've watched it. But, you know, the 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 beast of whatever, the rabbit, and the holy hand grenade part sticks in my head. Ugh. Okay, we're gonna reset down here. And we're gonna, we'll try to reset like two or three times and see will he attack us again or do we need to full reset kill Excalibur again? Blah, 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 blah. You've been a needy boy today, Otis. You've been a needy, greedy boy today, Otis. All right, last time, and then we're resetting, boy. We're resetting, boy. Okay, looks like we're resetting. Okay, we are going to pop out. We will pop in. We will kill these things. We will kill this thing. Oh, we didn't have to. Nice. I mean, we probably will have to because I think it moves. Apparently, Game Awards tonight? Yes, the Game Awards are on tonight. I considered watching them briefly when I when it was like, oh, things, this m stream might not be working out. I was like, mm, I could, like, watch the Game Awards, right? Beyonce likes stuff like that. You're not interested. I'm not, I'm not super, like, I want to know. We're going to try teleporting to see if we can save time this time. Uh, like, I want to know, but I personally don't want to watch this stuff. Okay. Does seem as if teleporting is a no-go, which is a bummer! Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Seems like too much fluff. Yeah, that's the thing. If if I was watching 30 minutes of game trailers and nothing in between, then I'd be down. But I don't want to sit there and listen to someone talk for five minutes and blah, 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 this and blah, 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 that and etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. So, I mean, I will, I will probably watch most of the game trailers over the course of the next couple days. But, you know, I'll just do them individually rather than actually... Oh, counter-resistance. Oh, 
Well, we solved that. Um, what is the easiest way to get... I guess actually going left. Probably just as fast either way. Doesn't matter. We're gonna have to fight some dragons either way. So we're gonna go up and left here. So maybe we only have to fight one group of dragons. Nice. You'll have to fight a bunch of groups. Of Don't put that evil on me. What are you doing? Why can't we be friends? Hmm. So, actually, Rogue Trader came out today. And I'm super interested in it as a game. But it's an owl cat game, so I expect it to be huge, and that makes me very hesitant to jump into it. Um, especially on launch, uh, owl cat games kind of notoriously are a bit. They're so large, so they're quite. Ah! They're quite buggy on launch, but. See, you put this evil on me. Now I do have to fight several groups of dragons. I believe you've done this. You're also interested? You don't have a PS5 or a computer that would run it? That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. Actually, I want to buy a new computer because I've been having too many problems with different games over the last two years, streaming them and playing them at the same time um which makes it to where i have to get a little more choosy about things or or i i, I guess i don't have to be choosy I, I i have to oh right i have to not stream play and record at the same time which is annoying unless rogue trader can run on a five-year-old laptop i mean it might be able to there's a lot of, like, graphical settings that you can mess around with in, in a game like that. So, as long as the actual, like, you know, optimization is there, it it could be possible. It kind of depends on the laptop, though, right? Like, if it, if it was a gaming laptop from five years ago, then I'd be like, oh, you're fine. But if it was just like a, oh, it's just a, you know, I, I bought a baseline laptop to... To do basic stuff on then it might not work out but you know you could always do a scenario like um well i mean if if you can run wrath of the righteous i would assume you can run um uh rogue trader honestly i don't i don't expect it to be that much more intensive from a from a gameplay standpoint that is almost only for roll 20 you play wrath on the ps4 ah and rogue traders not coming out on the ps4 Ugh, that's unfortunate please give me the thing you piece of shit how many times do i gotta kill this thing you you fucker Ah! It skipped PS4 and went to PS5. That's kind of garbage. Unfortunate. Hmm. Five more rabbits? Oh, God. Well, I mean, we did say, we did, like, establish our goals for the evening, so, you know, I won't complain too much, but damn. So only about 20 dragons? Jesus. Jeebus! 
Alright, well, you can't do anything now. You can, though. Gotta say, not a huge fan of unique having to farm unique monsters. Like, it's fine to have to farm other monsters for drops, but when it comes to unique, I, I, I'm kind of of the opinion of, like, it feels better when unique monsters are truly unique. You, you fight them once, you get everything that they drop, done. You know? And you don't fight them again, because they were unique monsters. Wrath of the... Speaking of Wrath, Lord of Nothing Shaman doesn't feel too good until 8 and 9. That's fair. Does it feel really good at 8 and 9? Because it's... I, I can see... There are a couple of other classes that really don't start to feel good until kind of like mid-game. Or mid-level. Maybe not mid-game. Depends on how, what, you're, what you're doing there. Like, um... Fucking... Fucking, um... It's not Beast Tamer. Yeah, no, it's Beast Tamer. Beast, Beast Tamer Bard um, did not, did not feel good at all until I think level five, because I think you get every, every odd level your um, summons increase in tier. So like level one, you just have the, the might and the might does nothing. It's trash. It's garbage. But level two, Three, I think you got the frogs, which were okay, but they weren't good. But level five, you got the fucking um, cheetahs, something cat-like. It wasn't. It's not the the big saber tooth cat, but it's uh, they're like leopards or something like that, and or or panthers or something. But those slapped. They were fantastic, and from then on, it was just. It, the, so from like level 5 to level 15 was god tier. Anything that you ran into trouble with, it was just like, oh, here, just let me pop my summons. I'll fucking destroy everything. You know? It was awesome. Are you kidding me, game? What, what's, what's this fucker's drop rate? What, what, what are you doing here? Common? Common, you say. Common. Common. If you have Ember and her Slumbo, you can common combo Dex Plague to one-shot any not-disease-immune en enemy. Wow. Holy fuck. Yeah, that's pretty good. That seems pretty good. Or if you get Corruptor, which is a new mythic. Corruptor is a new mythic. Interesting. You can also one-tap any enemy. Cool. Fucking dope. I really, I really did enjoy, um, like... I, obviously, I wasn't a big fan of them being used on me, but I loved using one-shot mechanics on enemies. Um, doing things like weird on massive clusters of enemies at the end game with Nenio was just like, mwah, it was just choice. Be being able to just be like, all of you are dead now, you know? Corruptor makes poison disease immune not matter. Interesting. That's actually kind of big because almost everything in that fucking game is... Poison immune. How about annoyance? With the element, with well, I was gonna say with the elementals, with the elements, you have a way to get around it with the mythic stuff, right? Like, cause you can take the the masteries that that make the immunities and resistances not matter, right? Like what you do with Ember, um, or what you do with like an Ice Witch or something like that, right? But I don't think that existed previously for poison. And like all the demons are fucking fully immune to poison, so 
the pain in the ass. Rephrase, poison disease immune still matters 80% of the time? Well, but in those particular cases when you're like, I know, you can make the conscious decision to say, I no longer want it to matter now, right? And then in that particular instance, that's really nice because that makes certain things actually usable. That's one of my gripes about Wrath of the Righteous and Kingmaker is, is that there are certain things in the games, there's so much stuff in there that is just very poorly balanced and it just doesn't, it just doesn't, it's not useful. It doesn't work at all. I cannot get this fucking item from this fucking rabbit. Are you kidding me right now? I blame you, fully. I might actually have to, like, see if I have some gear that increases drop rates or something like that. Like, holy shit. It'd be one thing if it was, like, with DeCapo, where I'm just, like, in and out of door, in and out of door, in and out of door. Right? Like, and just having to fight it. But this is a pain in the ass where I have to, I have to go kill another unique and then go through two groups of enemies to get back to the thing. Because I can't teleport. Alright, you do nothing. You do something. This is the run? Well, we just got another replica. So, you know. It can be done. Ooh, hard shells. I don't know. That might have used up my luck right there. Hmm. Also, I am totally maxed on, yeah, a bunch of shit. <sighs> I'm not going to do it right now. I'll do it after this run. I don't want to do it tonight at all, actually. Because I'm probably not going to be playing for much longer. I need, I need to sleep because I got project deadlines. So I have to actually hit, I have to be on point tomorrow. Even though I would rather not be on point tomorrow. Sleep is for the week, and I am very weak. I am a weak, weak baby boy. Just like this weak baby boy. He's like this weak boy. This weak boy right here, all he does is sleep. Sleeps 16 hours a day. Says, I'm trying, Papa. I be trying, Papa. I put a lot of effort into sleeping six, 16 hours a day. It's very tough work. Hey! Okay, can you can you just say that earlier next time? You mean like this is the run like three runs ago? Jesus. Alright. Carry crown. Done. Alright, we gotta go to Shambhala. Uh, we'll go do Aurora first, because I think Aurora is just sitting there every time. I think... Actually, I think Golden Boar Ba uh, will be there every time, too, as well. I was incorrect. Aurora is not there. Had to make me farm the rabbit five times like you originally said. I can't believe you've done this to me. I can't believe you've done this. Hmm... Okay. Um, dude, how do I spawn these? Let's go. Let's go talk to the fucking guild guy before I'm flying around for thirty years. Wait, where is he? Down here. Um, excuse me, guild guy. House in Shambhala, where a tree grows through the roof. I've heard if you carry at least a hundred k and have a bit of luck, a monster appears. Second, if you're lucky, you can find. Okay, so. This is literally just luck for us at this point. Gotcha. 
I bet we can just move in and out here to spawn Aurora. The rest will be one and dones. I don't know. But I mean, I mm, that might be calling it too quick. Okay, never mind. That was that was a one and done. <laughs> oh. Look, when you're right, you're right. Uh, what can I say? Uh, let's see if this is also a one and done. It's here. Magic resistance, you say? That one was not a one and done. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I see. I see you typed it just in time. Uh-huh. <laughs> ah, fuck. Oh, uh, can I... Can I just duck in and out? Will that work? Like it did with Aurora. It does. Nice. So, that's not too bad. Shiny belly! Okay, so it was a two and done. Alright. Whatever whatever magic you have going on, Wild. <laughs> like, what the fuck? That's some old bullshit right there. That's some that's some right bullshit right there. Don't get me wrong. I'm I'm pleased. But that's some right bullshit right there. Okay, so. The only thing we're missing is the goblin head from Bog the Real Gob. He's just a wild magic sorcerer. Look. I... What's the, the meme? I guess! Like... Rubber duck. Fuck yeah. Ultimate clothes. Fuck yeah. Ultimate robes. Fuck yeah. Ultimate heavy armor. Fuck yeah. We just need the goblin head. We've got to be able to get there somehow. Just don't know what that somehow is. I just don't know what that somehow is. Jesus. Jesus. You've just not been rolling poorly yet? That's fair. That is how the wild magic works. Alright. Um, I think that was literally everyone has maxed their class. Yes. Alright, well then... Just fucking remove everything. Okay. First person we do want to put specifics on is... 
I believe, Amalia. Because I want to teach her some magic spells, and in that scenario, I think she might actually be more useful. You haven't polymorphed yet? You, <laughs> you haven't fireballed the entire party? That's a good sign. That's a good sign. Alright. That is something that he does not have. That is something that he does not have. That is something that she does not have. That is something that she does not have. Something that she does not have. Boom. 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 Fuck yeah, okay, sweet. Set skills. I wish there was like a hotkey to like set um unlearned skills or to set like uh uh class skills. Roll twenty did that all Yeah. Sometimes it do be that way. The spell hit. You know what? Fuck it. Kind of just fucking around right now. Let's try to learn all the things, right? Auto shield. Uh, we need... Let's put whirlwind slash here. Um, and then everything else can get replaced. Try to maximize our SP usage. Uh, light sword, and we will put, um, what is it? Light claymore? And then everything else can get replaced. Because why not? It's fun to maximize stuff. Uh, what do we want? We're, we want Fire Jump as an AoE, and we want Heaven's Tear. A single target, everything else can get replaced. Oh. Oh, wow. She's basically done. I mean, okay, then. Um, let's put on other jumps. Because Heaven's Tear fully replaces all of the thrusts. So at that point, it's just a matter of, do you have a bunch of jumps? Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Ether Sucker. Life Sucker. Undead Killer and HP Sacrifice. Kasagiri, Yokogiri, um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Herbal Bruise, and Drunken Master, it looks like. Wind Slash, Lightning Rod, Provoke. Blade Reflection. HP up, which is quite useful. I kind of want that on everyone. And then Counter Attack, also interesting. Fall of Nature, whatever. Human Killer, whatever. Counter Attack, whatever. Easy Robbery. 
flashlights. Um, I like to keep Final Blossom so that she can actually do her full combo. Let's do Falling Dragon, Rising Dragon, though. Um, because some of these are single target, so that gives her that option. Uh, we will do Agi up. Poison hit. Put the damage up, eh? Um, we don't use him, we don't care. Replace all of his stuff with anything that he does not have max. Yep. Plant killer. SOS HP regen. Paralyze resistance. Cool. Does Falling Dragon, Rising Dragon combo into Dragon Rush? Uh, I wish it did, but it combos into Final Blossom. You forgot which game that came from. Otherwise, in your memory, otherwise you would clarify. I, it sounds familiar, but I also do not know what it comes from. Uh, Heroic Him and Heroic Ode and Healing Him are our two go-tos. So, we will leave those on. And then aside from that, light coat, dark coat. Interesting. It's maximizing things. Don't care what they are. Defense up. Counter magic up. Interesting. Silence hit. Dry Strike, and Specialist. Uh, I want Raise and Heal All. Specifically her Heal All, because it's a better Heal All. Um, and then everything else can be whatever. Raise All? Wow, I didn't realize I had that. Revival. Magic up. EP gain up. SOS. Best. Best the Flindle. Silver lining. Um, Celestial Light and, what, Light Burst, I think? Being like the go-tos. Search and... Green. All Out. Flash. Leader. Chemistry and Caretaker. You started a Monster Tactician playthrough on Wrath, and yes, it feels much stronger already than Beast Bar did. Fuck yeah. Play different classes as palette cleansers, so you don't get better burnt out. Yeah, absolutely. I think that's one of the, the charms of Wrath. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's got so much content for for the game. So I think it's really cool. Okay, we're still actually learning quite a bit on her. The Specious Darts. Oh, right there. Crit up! SOS TP regen! Dark Resistance, Defend, Gain, TP, and Silence Resistance. Interesting. Uh, we've got Magic Smash! Okay. Uh, and... Physical Wonder. There we go. I don't... I never use a gill. No, I think a is a very cool character. I just got him too late at the point to where I was like... What he does for me, I don't particularly care about. 
Um, but we're still going to try to, like, maximize his stuff, so. You know. I still think he's a very cool character for what, what he can do. That's without DLC? Have I played any of Wrath DLC? Uh, well... Did I play... I thought I got one of the DLCs. Um, but no. I, I don't think so, actually. I might have had one of the DLCs. Or I might have all of the DLCs, but I think I only played around with one. Um, so... Ignis and Ventus. Finish power, rushing anchor. That's all fine. Fire resistance. That's all fine. Plant killer. Dragon killer. Aquatic killer. Machine killer. Okay, cool. You haven't played any of the DL stories, but you played DLC classes. Gotcha. Okay, we have almost all of the stuff. We need to be able to get into Bog the Real Gobs scenario. And for that, I think we have to do... We're missing stuff in O'Grain. That's actually really interesting. I bet it's in the Goblin area, though. We have to beat all the unique monsters. Have to do Bog the Real Gob. We have to do the whole pig ear thing, which is not a big deal. Let's go to Perpetua. Has this changed? No passing here. It has not changed. You're ahead off? I'm glad you hung out as well. Thanks, Thanks for hanging out. Have a wonderful goblin hunt. I don't think I will be spending too long on it. I'm going to try one or two things and see if they pan out. And if not, then we'll be back at it Sunday night. Thanks for thanks for stopping by. I say Sunday night. We might play some tomorrow, but probably not. Yay, 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 yay. Ograin. Okay, we're going to go check these fuckers. We're also going to check this guy. We already know how to deal with well, I say we know how, but... Okay. If you're lucky, you'll find a unique monster in the west of Ograin. So that's just luck. It's an alpha male. All other enemies in the area disappear when it spawns. Secondly, people say a goblin takes its stroll somewhere in the northeast of Ograin. Apparently, it hates all goblins and wishes they were dead. Maybe it won't appear until all the other goblins are gone. Okay, got an idea here. We're going to... My issue is, is... I don't know... Oh! He spawned. I, I assume that means he spawned. Okay, cool. Let's, uh, let's see. Because there's no other Tad Eyes here, so it says all other enemies disappear when he... Ah, hello. Hello. Engage. Item. Sing, sing your Tad Eye. Okay, well, he does not immediately die, so... Uh... Fingers crossed. We do have Earth Strike. Let's do that. Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad. Didn't die from that. That's sketchy. 
die from that. That's okay. Okay, well, we didn't get whatever the fuck he drops, if he drops anything. Uh, inventory. No. Journal. Bestiary. Senior Tadai. Drops a Tadai eye. We're gonna farm that. We're gonna try to get that from him. Hey! Are we just... Is the luck on? Is that what's happening? Did I turn on luck hacks? I might have. You know, sometimes it do be that way. Heaven or hell? Okay, well, we're getting the spawns, but we're not getting the drops, so maybe maybe the luck hacks aren't actually on. I don't even know if I need this fucking thing, though, but... Now that we know what we're doing, pretty easy to spawn him. And very easy to deal with, so that's good. Got I I Nice, okay. We did that thing. Let's go. See these fucking goblins. And from there, I actually do feel like I have a plan. Okay, I feel like I have a plan. Um, there are other goblins in Ograin down in the bottom left. So what we are going to do is we are going to uh, teleport back here. We're going to go kill all of the different groups of goblins that we are aware of. And then we're going to go try to spawn that guy. Pretty sure it's just like two or three groups of goblins over here to the west. Rainbow ore from that guy? Holy shit. What? I think there might be a group over here. Okay. 
And then I think there's a group up here. Nope, I was wrong. I think there's one more group. I don't remember specifically where they are. Ah. Somebody got a skill up. Who got it? I kind of wish it told you who was on the docket. Alright, I do think that that's it, but I wanted to verify. Now, we can't teleport back. But I think that's it as far as goblins go. So... Now, if that's the case, I see how I could have done this way, way earlier. My bad. But, you know, sometimes you don't realize what the trigger is. Sneaky, sneaky game. gonna go down here and double check yep nothing down there i do think it's just those three although there might be some on one of the islands in the water but i don't think so okay so now we're gonna go back to that goblin um who's kind of like keeping us out of the area and we're gonna see if that changes i'm guessing that it doesn't because I'm actually betting that what happens is is if we go north and to the entrance from Ramana's tower that he's going to be up in that area and that once we kill him then we're going to be allowed back in here that is my guess hey how's it going Galactic Baron how you be Oh, it's getting late. I need to wrap this up. <laughs> no coincidence. I've just been playing longer than I had originally intended. Whoa! Almost didn't make that turn. Gotta finish this beer. We're on a strict beer schedule. Game Awards are finally over, so you're finally unmuting. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, we were just talking about the Game Awards earlier. Anything, anything fun? Ooh, there are two... Oh, cause that's because I think they're down south. It says he's walking around in the northeast. So I'm betting it's up there that he's walking around. Yeah, because we don't want to go here. So I'm going to move in and out of this space and see if that triggers. Um, and we'll see. They announced the new Streets of Rage and Revenge of Shinobi. That's fucking cool. All right. No dice there. I'll try this another, like, two or three times. And then we'll see... We'll see what... What we do there. A new Jet Set Radio! I have a friend that is going to be very excited about that. That's cool. Hmm. That was one. This will be two. The cra I did hear something about Crazy Taxi, actually, on one of the discords I'm on. 
Golden Axe, which you're not confident in, but we'll see. That could be interesting. But yeah, I'm not like... Mm. Fuck. Doesn't seem like any dice on this particular front. Um... Man, we'll try one more time. Maybe we're just getting unlucky, but it doesn't feel like it. It doesn't it doesn't feel like this one should be down to luck. It feels like this one is a if you fulfilled the requirements. Good spawn. Alright, fuck it. I kind of want this done tonight, so I am probably going to actually look this one up. Uh, Chained Echoes. Fog the real gob. What did I fail? Ooh, well, it looks like the the space is correct. I, I got the correct space. I also got that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Gotta go ho do the whole Romanus thing. Yep, yep. Hold the phone. What? What? I'm gonna lose my fucking mind. Okay, that's the thing. So, yeah, we 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 can't spawn Bog the Real Gob because we have not done this quest. That's the that's the thing. Is we we cannot do it because we have not we have not done this quest. Um Okay, well, I'm not going to look up that quest. Not at the moment, anyways. I might look it up next time we play if I can't figure it out. But it's one thing for me to look up, like, the location of something. And it's another thing to look up triggers and things like that. Um, so I would rather not do that. That, I think, means that we are probably at the end of tonight's session. So I'm going to go ahead and save. We made some good progress. Uh, we did... What did we do? We defeated the Kraken. That was fun. Uh, we got... 10 of the 12 ultimate weapons, upgraded them all, swapped all our crystals over, got those outfitted. We found three more souls of Farnese, which means that we can upgrade an 11th weapon and get it equipped, and that we are prepared for when we, if we find the final uh, weapon. Maybe final two weapons, because I don't know why we have three when we only have two weapons left, but that's a question for another day. Um, we ground out all of the additional materials that we needed to finish all of the deals, except for Bog the Real Gob's head, which we cannot trigger because of needing to do a quest. Um, and we actually did quite a few little quests. So we, we have, uh, we found the new class emblem, which is like the Mage Knight or something like that. Um... And we did a we did the tad eyes. We actually got quite a bit of stuff done. So we have very few things left on the um, on the reward board. A couple of them are locked behind other things, I believe. Right, uh, like this O'Grain thing. I believe both of those tre treasure chests are in the area that we can't get into before we do this whole goblin's dilemma thing. Um, I believe that we can do the Earthworms quest. We have a pretty good plan for that. 
and we can easily do the pig ear quest. We just haven't done it yet. Um, I think all of the elemental tablets allow us to summon God King Gamdriel for that fight. Um, which, defeating Bog the Real Gob and God King Gamdriel will complete this one, which is defeat all unique monsters. And then the last thing is this fucking Perpetua stuff, which we've got to get rid of those vines, but I don't know how we do that. So, it might end up being that we have to do a little bit of a world tour next time and actually go talk to everyone and see if we can figure out what's going on with the Goblin's Dilemma and the, uh, the vines and blah, 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 and see how that goes. So, um, we'll see. But yeah, overall, I think we're we're really getting there. Um, so that's pretty nice. We got to keep an eye on our SP as we do these things because we're also trying to get... We're probably trying to get all the achievements, which means we need a couple more. Uh, we need to beat the game. Whatever. Finish all side quests. That is going to require doing the whole Bog the Real Gob thing. Um, we have Slay the Ultimate Boss, which is listed as God King. So I'm assuming that's God King Gamdriel, right? Defeat all unique monsters. Also on the docket, right? Get all ultimate weapons. We're working towards that. Complete the bestiary, which I think is just going to be the bosses that we have remaining. Um, learn all skills on all characters. That's that thing where we're trying to maximize our SP and, and basically get all of the class skills on everybody. Um, I don't know if that means we're going to need to fully maximize everyone to have all of the, the grims, like the passives and everything like that. I don't know. Buy all deals. As soon as we be, can do Bog the Real Gob, we'll have that. Um, and then complete the reward board. So all of that kind of like tying together, um, kind of, kind of, kind of getting there. I, I think as long as we can figure out things, um, specifically with this goblin quest and with the, uh, vines, I think we'll be able to make a lot of progress the next time we play, which will be pretty cool because I think if that's the case, we'll only have a couple sessions left of this game, uh, and we'll be able to finish it out. It's been going really well, so... Um, that is going to be the end of this session. Um, and it's really late and I'm really tired, so we're probably not going to raid out. So that's going to be it. We are off tomorrow. No drunk stream tomorrow. Um, uh, we're taking a break uh, in between games at the moment. Uh, we will probably be back next Friday with a big group thing. Um, so we'll see how that goes. If if people are okay with me streaming it. We're, I, we're planning a big group thing with a bunch of friends. So if people are okay with me streaming it, then I'll stream it. Otherwise, we'll be off on that Friday as well. But it is the holiday season. We'll see how it goes. Uh, we will definitely be back on Saturday with, I believe, the completion of Wizard with a Gun. So we have no idea how long that'll take Jay and I to finish, but we don't we don't expect it to take a super long time. We'll see. Anyways, thanks for hanging out. We'll see you next time. Bye bye everybody. Hey everybody, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider leaving a like, commenting, or subscribing. It really helps me out. If you'd like to see me live, head over to my Twitch at twitch.tv/thedistanthorizon. forward slash